go over a couple of my trades today. Uh, I had two trades and I'll save the best for last, Genus. So UAVS, I actually had to cut losses quickly on it. Uh, I like the filing that they released. So my goal was to anticipate the stock going back to green and being able to continue. So I was trying to get in at the 145s, then I started adding in on the way up. Uh, and then I got caught in this kind of fall right here. I had to cut losses at 140. Uh, but it wasn't a really big deal. Uh, I didn't really do much to my account, but I was pretty happy that I was able to focus on other plays that were going to affect my account in a good way. So this is genius right here. Uh, my past three videos I actually included this stock in there. So my first video in that three part series was how I was able to profit on this breakout day. Uh, the second video that I released yesterday was how I refused to get faked out at the very top over there when people thought it was going to kind of keep breaking out, keep running. Uh, and a lot of people were actually laughing at me because I said that I was uh, out of fear. I didn't get in like I was too scared, right? They were laughing at me and I'm like, I agree. It is out of fear. It is weak. I'm just going to focus on plays that are easy and obvious. Um, so then I started predicting what was going to happen next and... For on this red day, I predicted that there was going to be a panic. Uh, so honestly, personally, I personally don't consider that a panic. I consider this more of a fade. Um, and then, so I wanted to get in on a dip buy off a panic. Um, and then I eventually found shares to short. It wasn't able to uh, break the 150 area convincingly. Uh, so if you want to see my live trading on Genus, stay tuned, it's coming right up. So right now I am short Genus. I finally found shares to short. Uh, it wasn't being uh, it wasn't being able to break that 150 area convincingly, so I shorted at 148. My plan is to cover in the 130s, and I'm actually planning on uh, my cover order to also add in shares on the long for the dip at the same time. So I'm going to record some live trading of my attempt on that. All right, okay, so, so I'm going to try, try and get, get out at 139. 139. If, uh, oh, I missed it. it. All right, so I got out at 140, and that uh, order actually covered my short. It also made me go on the long side, so now I'm long a uh, quarter, I mean a third of my position. So I'm going to start looking to add in if it keeps going to the 130s. Uh, so I put my order in. Hey, there we go. That was a pretty cool trade. Pretty happy with that. Yeah, so that was pretty much how to go long and short on the same stock uh, in a nutshell. So uh, my plans going forward on Genus, I'm not really expecting too much. Uh, I'll be looking at it for any more panics, ideally in the morning. But right now I'm just going to be focusing on other big plays that'll uh, yeah, keep growing my account. So thank you for watching.